This is question two. The College Board is asking us for an expression for the amount of time to finish painting a set of checkers. We've already painted C checkers out of 24 checkers. So the number of checkers remaining is the total number 24 minus the number that we've painted. It's 24 minus C. And then it takes 35 minutes for each of them. So the total time will be 35 minutes times the number of checkers which is choice C. Choice is B and D give you a negative number. C, the number of, paint, of checkers painted, has to be less than 24. And so C minus 35 would be negative times 24 is a negative time to finish, which doesn't make sense. Similarly, C minus 24 here is also negative times 35 minutes per checker gives you a negative time, which again doesn't make sense. Choice A, we're subtracting the number of checkers that have been painted from the time to, per checker to paint, and that does not make sense. So C is the only choice that would make sense. We're taking the total number of checkers minus the number that have already been painted to get the total number remaining, multiply the number remaining by the time per checker, and that is the time to paint all the remaining checkers. College Board often asks you to write an expression or an equation based on a word problem like we've done here. So make sure this makes sense and come back soon for my next video. With math there's always more.